Visibility of your cloud costs is the critical component to successful cloud financial management. Lexera One Cloud Cost Optimization lets you bring in cost from any cloud vendor. Public clouds, including non-Western vendors and regions, private clouds, or indeed any other source of cost. For example, staff or resourcing costs, software licensing, and other on-premise overheads can be brought in alongside your cloud spend and allocated to provide a total cost of ownership view. Once ingested, Flexera provides a rich set of dashboard and reporting capabilities that all support a hybrid and multi-cloud view of cost. There are a range of ways you can then categorize or allocate that cost for showback or chargeback use cases. You can categorize your spend by a range of dimensions, including those provided by the cloud vendor, such as region and service, or via tags applied to resources or cloud accounts, but also by creating custom dimensions, which can be integrated with other sources of business metadata, such as a CMDB or enterprise architecture tools to help complement your cloud vendor tagging strategy and provide contextualization of your cloud spend in ways you really didn't think were possible. As well as graphical reports and dashboards, our tabular report provides an interactive pivot of your multi-cloud and other ingested costs. Reports can be produced for a wide range of stakeholders from finance and executive level reports to product and engineering teams who may need much more detail. You can bring in multiple dimensions to support any chargeback or showback use case. Furthermore, via our billing center structure, shared costs can be allocated on a proportional basis, but also based on other usage metrics. So cost allocation can be formed based on consumption of other services or indeed other sources of data. Billing centers also act as role-based access control boundaries, meaning that you can provision users via single sign-on and give them access to the cost data that is relevant to their role or function. Even when those costs span multiple clouds, hybrid use cases or accounts. And finally, unit economic KPIs can be produced by ingesting additional metrics. For example, the number of transactions, customers served, or items produced over a period of time, and using these metrics can empower you to make decisions about your cloud spend based on business outcomes instead of technical outcomes.